I'm really proud of myself for how much I've learned to hold my ground boundaries and now refuse to be talked to in ways that I don't deserve anymore after having lived most of my life as an unrealized PDA autist surrounded by abuse, discriminations, and violences. I could have easily continued to drink myself to death instead, but I've made concerted decisions to live healthier and unmasked as who I genuinely am in a world that literally hates me for it. I want to add something to this though. By the way, it's a privilege to be able to do that. Like, not everyone can fucking do that, just to be clear. We know that obviously being able to unmask is a privilege. I digress. If you don't like that, and you likely have no idea who I am beyond a surface level perception of me, I don't give a fuck. The amount of times I've done or said something and then been treated terribly for no legitimate reason is off the fucking charts, and I mostly fawned Frozen as a trauma response. I masked as someone I'm not for most of my life and was continuously violated anyway. Now that I'm finally living as myself, if someone doesn't like that and gives me literally no room to even hear me, they can fuck off. I know the consequences of living as a masked autist for 30 years and the self-hatred and self-harm that that path causes. I refuse to do that.